Hi, this is Scott Campbell with SDC Guitars once again. I thought I would show you a little project that we're working on. It's a uh, Martin D18 that has definitely seen better days. It has, uh, as you can tell, been loved on quite a lot. Seen a lot of songwriting, seen a lot of playing. The only problem is, as I show you, I'll flip the guitar over. A roadie kicked a hole in the side of the guitar and uh, now it needs to be fixed. What we're going to do is, if you can see right here, we're going to put this wood back together. We're going to put this wood over here back together. Then I'm going to cut out and patch. So it's going to be a uh, fairly interesting piece. Fun to watch as we uh, get it done. Back again with the Martin D18. Yesterday I glued up the first side of the, uh, of the kick in and uh, just clamped it with violin clamps. Put some splines on the back of it to make sure everything was nice and stable. It is good and stable now. The next part of it is going to be gluing up the back side. Um, this is a lot more difficult of a clamp job because the brake uh, sheared the the wood at an angle, and so when you clamp it, it pops out. So I had to make a, uh, a call out of plexiglass, and I've got one, two, four, six clamps on it with a spline in the back of it to make sure that everything is level and even with itself. Um, this is just a dry run. Um, I'm going to cool it here in a minute, which is going to be fun. You have to do it fast. Um, but it uh, should work. Everything's uh, working out on the dry run fine. Uh, we'll get back to you when we have a little the uh, blue job on the uh, bottom bout of the guitar done. As you can see, everything's nice and flat. Got our uh, splines on the inside to make sure everything stays where it's supposed to stay. And uh, now we're getting ready to build the jig so I can router and uh, clean out the pocket so that I can make a, another side and I'm going to bend. There's my side material. I'm going to go right in there like that. I'll put some perfing on there, the side of it, and stick the whole thing in. And progress that I've made on this uh, Martin. Uh, the other day I bent my wood for the, uh, the side and trimmed it up and fit it in. Um, if you see right now I've got clamps on it, kind of just making sure everything is in there tightly and that all my lines match up and uh, that uh, the side is nice and even. So the next thing I'm going to do is glue it in and uh, then I'll start on the finishing process, the sanding, base coating, uh, filling, things like that. So uh, anyway, that's it right there.